American Airlines flight attendants want to leave the negotiating table and go on strike against the Fort Worth-based airline. Fox 4's Dan Godwin live at DFW Airport with an update. Dan? And Lauren, this is the kind of labor dispute that makes travelers wonder if there's going to be some kind of major disruption when airlines and airports are at their busiest. But American Airlines says even if there is a strike, it wouldn't happen until after the holiday travel season on Monday in the middle of Thanksgiving travel. The union representing 26,000 American flight attendants turned up the pressure on the carrier. The APFA sent a letter to the government agency that mediates contract disputes asking for permission to strike. The union and the Fort Worth-based carrier failed to agree on a new contract. By last Friday's deadline, workers have not seen raises since 2019. We came to negotiate last week. The company did not, and so we are done. Time's up. We have waited long enough. We're not going to wait any longer, and so we've taken this important step. But a strike can't happen until the National Mediation Board signs off on it. If it does, flight attendants must wait 30 days before walking off the job. They are asking for a 35% raise along with bigger retirement fund contributions. American Airlines told us on Monday it disputes that unions claim that negotiations are over. The carrier says it's willing to continue talks and hopes to reach an agreement. Live at DFW, Dan Godwin on Good Day.